you can link Revit models to other Revit models. This is useful when collaborating with other disciplines, or when parts of a large project have been created as separate models, and you want to assemble those parts together in a single Revit project. The current project is a site model. The actual building has been modeled in a separate Revit project file. To link the building model into the site, on the Insert ribbon, in the Link panel, click Link Revit. Revit displays the Import Link RVT dialog. You can navigate to the folder containing the file you want to link. Select RevitLink.RVT. When you do, you can see a preview of the model. Pay attention to the positioning dropdown. Expand the dropdown to display the six options for placing the linked Revit file into the current model. Auto, Center to Center, automatically places the linked file so that its geometric center is located at the geometric center of the current model. You would typically choose this option when you plan to adjust the location later. Auto, Origin to Origin, automatically places the linked file so that its origin is located at the origin of the current model. In most cases, this is the preferred method. Auto, by shared coordinates, places the linked file at the shared origin position. You would choose this option if both files are already part of the same shared coordinate system. The manual options allow you to place the link manually with the cursor located at one of the three locations in the linked file, at the origin of the linked file, at the base point of the linked file, or at the geometric center of the linked file. You then specify the insertion point by picking the location in the host file. Choose Auto Origin to Origin and then click Open. Once Revit reads the file and brings it in, you can see it within the host model. When you select the linked model, the entire model is treated as one object. Looking in the Properties palette, you can see that it's a linked Revit model, and that it has a name value separate from the actual file name. There is also a shared site parameter that is currently not shared. When you click the button in the Value field, Revit displays the Share Coordinates dialog. Here, you can either publish the coordinates of the host file into the linked file, or you can acquire the coordinates from the linked file. Best practice is to publish coordinates from a site model to a building model while working in a site model, or acquire coordinates from a site model to a building model while working in a building model. Publishing the shared coordinate system of the host file into the linked file will modify all sites or named positions in the linked file. Therefore, the shared coordinate system in the linked file will be updated to match the shared coordinate system in the host file. Acquiring the shared coordinate system from the linked file will modify the shared coordinate system of the current project and will also modify all the sites of other linked models. Simply click Cancel for now to close the dialog without making any changes. With the linked Revit model still selected, on the Contextual ribbon, in the Link panel, there are two tools. Bind Link will convert the linked Revit model into a group within the host file. Manage Links will open the Manage Links dialog. Note that the Manage Links tool is also available on the Insert ribbon in the Links panel, and on the Manage ribbon in the Manage Project panel. You can also access this tool from within the Project Browser. Scroll down, right-click Revit Links, and then choose Manage Links. Each Manage Links tool opens the Manage Links dialog. You can use the controls in this dialog to manage several different types of linked files, 
including linked Revit models. You can also add linked Revit models using the Add tool in this dialog. To see this, first remove the linked file by selecting it in the Manage Links dialog and clicking Remove. Then click OK to continue removing the link. Now you can use the Add tool to link the same Revit model to this project. When you click Add, Revit displays the Import Link RVT dialog. Once again, you can navigate to the folder containing the file you want to link. Select RevitLink.RVT. Now when you expand the positioning drop-down, there are only three options for placing the linked Revit file into the current model. The manual options are not available since you are using the tool from inside a dialog. This is because you would not be able to place the linked file into the project by picking the appropriate position. Choose Auto, Center to Center, and then click Open. Once Revit reads the file and brings it in, you can see it in the Manage Links dialog. Click OK to close the dialog and see the linked model in the host model. Also, pay attention to the new location. Remember that the first time, the position was set to Auto, Origin to Origin, whereas this time, Auto, Center to Center was used. 